ball. Hayford charged him down. It's hit his back and it's bubbled in. And Town have got what they deserve. 1-1 after the middle. Another historic night for David Wagner's Huddersfield Town. Everyone remembers what game it was and where they were. For me, it was dancing around our bedroom in my wife's dressing gown. After two wins on the bounce, the draw lay at Aston Villa, I thought we could be in for a special one. Expectations after last season were mid-table, made the John Smith Stadium a bit of a, a fortress, big leads, that kind of thing. You could sense the change even when Wagner first came in. Here's someone who wants to build an identity from within, a style of play that entertains but doesn't lose that grit or that, that bite that we love to see. Even the most sceptical of fans could sense there was a bit of a renaissance, a revolution, if you will. I mean, after pre-season, well, with the transfers, you wonder, of course, you're hopeful until they let you down, and that would be typical town. But I'll support them whatever and wherever they go. You keep the faith. One game, you take with a pinch of salt. Two, and especially one you don't expect to get anything from, is a bonus, because they'll lose the easier home game. Three, getting a point away at Villa Park after going a goal down. That ain't about. Four, the easy home game. Here we go. Normal service resumed. 2-1 Huddersfield Town. 2-1 Huddersfield Town. Kachunga the supplier again. Hogg turned neatly and lifted the ball high past the Barnsley keeper. Could be the winner in the penalty area. Huddersfield count two. 